Hey guys, it's Shark with DG, and if you guys would like to submit your own clip, be sure to check the description for my clip submission form. Anyways, on to the video. These are a few clips. Sorry for bad quality. Didn't realize I streamed in a 720p. It's all good, homie. We can't all stream in high quality. It's respectable. Alright, so let's check this clip out. You're playing Ella. We love to see it. We love Ella. No recoil. Awesome. Must have watched one of my videos. Nice. Okay. Uh, it looked like you were using muzzle break. I hope you were using muzzle break. It looked like you were. The recoil control was really solid. And it looked like you had a good understanding of how many bullets to shoot with Ella before you basically run out of able, like, blah, 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 before you're able to not control the recoil anymore. Because basically with Ella, if you shoot more than like, I think it's 16 or 17 bullets, the recoil is pretty much uncontrollable. So the way to control her recoil is to, I think muzzle break is the best barrel attached right now. And then shoot like less than 16 bullets. Like if you don't kill him in the first 16 bullets, you probably lost the gunfight. The main thing I see with this is like cross replacement at the start was all right. But the second one, it kind of like when you're looking towards this door, it looked a little bit low in my opinion. Um, Cause like head would probably be here and your cross is like down here. If he was crouched maybe, or if he was further back. Um, and then also like when you turned, like you were looking into the wall a bit, like when you were here. Uh, I mean, it's not the worst thing ever. It's just something to work on when you're like aim treading. You should work on like practicing your 180s while ADS or, you know, just practice flicking at things while ADS or 180s in general while hip fire. Just so, just so your movements are a little bit more clean. And then your crosshair placement was a little bit bad coming to this door. So if he was crouched, you probably would have been on him. But since he wasn't, you had to make an adjustment. So you can see you flicked up to his head. Luckily, you got him and he didn't kill you. Um, but I would say cross replacement and movement is the number one thing to be working on in this. So let me look up your rank. Um, I would assume that you're probably a solid gold one player. Um, gold one to plat three. I, I say gold one to plat three a lot, but I, that is, you have to remember, that is near the average, like, uh, rank is like around gold. So uh, I got you. Okay. So yeah, gold, you hit plat three, you're gold two now. Yeah. So that, that kind of... I'm not too surprised. It looks like you've gotten like significantly better. You, you know, you were bronze, then silver, uh, gold, and then you came with the plat. So uh, I'll give it to you this this season. Maybe you're having a bad season. Maybe you haven't played much. Uh, you know, bad places, whatever. Uh, but yeah, I, I'm not surprised with the gold two so much. I think you'd easily hit like plat three like consistently if you just practice on your mechanical skill a bit. Um, so okay, yeah. we have to watch Basilisk clip. Basilisk is a must watch. Hold on. This is my Twitch mod, and I genuinely don't know what his rank is. I'm gonna be guessing his rank here. Okay, let's see this. Okay, so that wasn't bad. Basilis, you do seem a bit lost here. I'm not gonna lie, you seem a bit lost, bro. <laughs> like right here, you had a hard, like hard whiff a bit, uh, but not bad. All right, Basilisk, I'm going to say is plot one to two. So let me go to tab. I might be completely off here, but I f I've played with Basilisk before, and I feel like he could easily hit plot one if he, like, had a good stack. So let's see. It looks like his account's unranked. Uh, wow. Okay. Um, so that's interesting. All right, yeah, Basilisk is unranked on everything, which is strange. Let's look up his main account. So that's not Basilisk's main account. There we go. So this is Basilisk's main account. Gold one right now. Wow, you're a career gold. Um, actually, very surprising, Basilisk, because I've played with you before, and your mechanical skill looked as if you could be a solid plat two to plat one player. I think the problem with Basilisk is that he probably trolls a lot, like as you can see from his bio on R6 tab. He paid R6 premium or R6 tab premium to have this Watch here. Mine, wink face. I will, bro. Thanks for the hundred bits. Um, so yeah, I, I think Bass's problem is he trolls too much. <laughs> okay, here we go. You were three back. All right, let's, let's check this out. 11 second ace in champion elo. All right, we will see if it's champion elo. If it's not though, I still respect it, bro. Don't worry. I still respect it. Okay. Cross replacement and all that seems to be pretty good. Okay, this is pretty good so far. 
Ooh, that okay, that guy got slammed. That was nice. That's a good clip. Uh Okay, that was AIDS. Uh Honestly, there's not many things I can say that you did wrong in this clip. I think overall it was a pretty solid clip. There's not many tips I could really give you. I mean, I guess the only thing I can say is you're being really aggro. Um but like hey, at the same time, like I think you were in a 1v5, so like I can't really fault you on that. <laughs> Um, but yeah, so let me look up your account really quick. All right, so I don't I don't know if I guessed the rank, but I was gonna guess high plat, and yeah, it it looks like I'm about right. Plat plat one to plat two, so yeah, uh, that makes sense. I could definitely see you being in like a high plat player. One point six KD, that is a really high KD. Uh, I should add, that is a really high KD, and you have a decent amount of games played. Um, seasonals are Zofia and Jaeger. Overall is Ash Jaeger. That I don't doubt. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't, I don't think I guess what your rank was going to be, but I'm not surprised by plot two, plot one. That, that seems a pretty accurate, to be honest. That's Bass's clip. Okay, we can watch this one real quick. Let's see. Let's see, let's see. All right, not bad, I guess. Okay, I like that you. Okay, so there's there's one thing I see wrong so far, but there's one thing you did really right. So instead of just preeming at the ground to get your kill, I liked how you ADS into the room to actually see if anyone was peeking, like if, if anyone was trying to bait the cav, because a lot of the times people would like preem the ground where the cav was downed at, and if there was someone like this Jaeger who's peeking the window or the shield. You might have died if you were aiming at it. Although I will say the first thing that I saw there is just that your crosshair placement was a bit low. Um, yeah, so like it still is. So if anyone was peeking the shield, you're just like a foot beneath the shield. So like you might have died. Like you fixed it for there. Um, but that's like the main thing I saw. So far, yeah. So far, your crosshair placement just seems to be really low. And like it's working because these guys are like really like crouching around. Um, I would say this is definitely like gold three. I, I would like... I would say probably gold two, gold three. So let's let's bring up the tab again and let's let's check it out. I'm gonna say gold two, gold three. So let me look up your replay real quick. Okay, so let's check this out. Uh, yeah, so I was I was right. Uh, gold two. Um, you you peaked at gold one last season, which is that's good. I mean, you don't seem necessarily bad. I think. Let me see. I'm, yeah, you seem to not play that many games, so I can't really fault you on, like having poor cross replacement or, or whatever else um so yeah i i think the main thing is fix your cross replacement and have a little bit more confidence in your peaks you seem to be a little bit hesitant to peak or you have to like you have to like aim through the wall to line up your kill so i would just say um practice on mechanical skill for the most part and you'd probably be fine okay well i think we might do one more for anti here to make it like a, a solid close to an hour and then we might cut it off so let's see anti's clip right here so he titled it 3k so this is a vigil 3k i guess i think it is nice i like the impact for distracting that was good you're using you're utilizing your utility pretty well for like distractions okay so I like how you, I like I like where you're playing. It's like a, a nice rat spot. It worked out pretty well. Your crosshair placement was good there. That was a nice shot. I liked how you used the impact grenade to distract the IQ. That was a good play. Uh, and I like how you use the other impact grenade as well for Z. So if there's anyone yellow or or Z, um, peeking, they would look at that first. Uh, good plays. I think that was a good utilization of your impacts. Um, yeah. Overall, I think this is a really solid clip. There's not much you did wrong. I actually liked pretty much everything you did here. Um, so I'm going to guess that you're a solid plat one player, maybe even diamond. Like I, I wouldn't be surprised if I see you at diamonds. So let me, like, if you had a good stack, I feel like you'd easily hit diamonds. So let me look up your account real quick. You might be one of the highest ranks today. I'm, I'm not actually sure. So let's, let's see it real quick. Yeah. So diamond. Yeah. As I said, I wouldn't be surprised to see you with diamond elo. So as I expected, like definitely like that was the solid aim, solid cross replacement. The plays with the impact grenades was really solid. Um, you know, as you see, you've definitely gotten a lot better at the game. You can see you've gone from silver two all the way up to diamonds. Um, so yeah, I mean, 
I, I think I got that pretty accurate there with the rank. The, I mean, overall, it's really solid clip. Cross replacement and all that was good, as I said. So yeah, that, that was actually pretty good.